Chief Executive Officer of Cinema One, Ingrid Jara, said there's a shortage of investments being put into women-led organizations. She noted a recent study conducted by the IMF. It was discovered that in emerging markets, private equity and venture capital, excluding China, a mere 8% of senior investment professionals were women. And they accounted for only 10% in developed markets. Speaking at the People's National Movement's International Women's Day Celebration and Awards Ceremony, Ms. Jara said this lack of investment will result in dire consequences. The latest UN report in September 2023, Progress on the Sustainable Development Goals, reported that 340 million women and girls are set to live in extreme poverty by 2030 if nothing changes. The world is falling short of achieving gender equality for 2030. Meanwhile, Chairman of the PNM's Women's League, Camille robinson Regis, says the party is investing in women and girls. This party has ensured that we have invested significant sums of money into our education system and to ensure the success of all people, but particularly females in Trinidad and Tobago. Among the awardees at the ceremony were Marilyn Gordon, Antoinette Valdez, Francine Edwards, Cynthia Bartlett, Annette Perrot, and Cheryl Duff. Terry Ann Brown Campbell, TTT News.